The introduction of new taxes and increment are coming at a time when many customers are reeling from economic hardships. The shop in Osu deals in electrical appliances. The 2.5 increment by government has been, we, it has taken effect. We resumed today, so immediately we came in, we started implementing it, and so far we've not had any issues from any of the uh, customers because already it's a law we are just implementing, so that has been the case so far. Stephen Ture just bought a bag. The deducted 2.5, as we yeah, are think as it was stated in the budget, then it has taken effect. Certainly it's hard on the pocket, uh, you can't run away from that, but as the saying goes, it looks like we need to pay tax to be able to uh, develop the country. So it's, it's, it's hard for us, but we're taking it a bit easy. For Francis Etty, the increment is necessary if the revised rate serves the right purposes. I think it's necessary. You know, taxes are important. It's what helps the country develop. You get hospitals, roads, you know, so I think it's important. The biggest issue is making sure that that gets done. That's it. This perfume shop on the busy stretch of the Oxford Street attracts a lot of customers. The 2.5 VAT increment had taken effect. The 2.5 VAT has taken place here. And I started working on our goods. And honestly, it's not easy because sometimes when customers come in and you mention new prices, they be like, sometimes they even feel you are cheating them. They rather fail to know that the VAT has gone up. People don't really look at that because all they know is I'm coming to get something. All their mind is, is, is on the dollar rate. So if the dollar has come down, they think the dollar is the only thing that affects everything. The tax hike comes as the country is in the midst of struggling to meet debt repayments and is seeking a new plan with the International Monetary Fund, IMF. Government announced an increment in the rate of the value added tax, VAT rate, by 2.5%. Finance Minister Ken Oforiata presenting the 2023 budget statement to Parliament noted that the increment will lead to a massive infrastructural drive. We are proposing the implementation of the new revenue measure. The major one is an increase in the VAT rate 25.2.5 percentage points to help with roads and technology improvement. This increase is expected to yield 2.7 billion, which will be used, as I mentioned, to augment funding for our road infrastructure development and digitalization. Godwin Asidiba, TV3, Accra.